And especially uh, the hearts, the hearts, if you send me hearts, I'm always like, which I don't know who came up with that. Or if that's like a normal thing that creators do. But. <laughs> yeah, just like that. <laughs> Whoever said that definitely likes to. Sometimes I feel like that, Jeremy. Sometimes I'm like, okay, maybe, you know, they're, what is it called? Undecided. You know, and they were just like, well, I will say that this guy I used to date would say that to his friends, but not only would he say that, he would actually go in his roommate's room and kiss him on the forehead. And, like, not in a joking way. Like, he literally would kiss him. And that wasn't the only sign that I was, like, there was, like, a bunch of other things he did that I was, like, that's not normal. Which is, like, fine, but be honest, you know? Like, I don't want to be with someone that's, like, not into me. <laughs> I don't want to be those 40-year-old women who are, like, married with five kids and my husband's just like, I like boys now. I would literally, I would <laughs> literally, I'm not even over-exaggerating. That'd be so bad. I would cry. Have a good evening, gorgeous. See you around. I'll see you, John. Thank you so much for being here. It is common, Alex. Yeah, it is very common. Nowadays, it's, like, really normalized, which, you know, is fine and all if you want to do you, but if you were to do that to someone that you were, like, married to, and you were just like, yeah, so, I mean, imagine being married to, I mean, I don't know if it's the same for guys, like, imagine being married, or how y'all would feel about this, but imagine being married to a woman, okay, um, being married to a woman for 10 years, y'all ha have how many of her kids together, and then all of a sudden she's like, and you thought, like, this is the woman I'm going to spend the rest of my life with, and one day she literally was just like, peace out, girls now, like, I like women now. How would y'all feel, like, actually? Like, that is the love of your life. And, like, you can't do anything about it. So she's not dead. She's just choosing not to be with you. But then it's kind of like a confidence thing because then it's like, well, was I so bad that they, like, did a little switcheroony? Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know, that would just be awful. And the fact that that's so common these days, like, I've heard of 